One of the most important things to know before starting any ExoShield installation is how to keep your workspace contamination free. Take the time to clean your workspace as well as do a thorough cleanup on all the areas you'll be working around on the vehicle. Sometimes it's just easier to do a full exterior wash. This preparation step will set the tone for the rest of the installation. Now it's time to start removing things that could be in your way, like cowlings and wipers. The more thorough you can be now, the less contamination you'll have to deal with later on in the installation. There's nothing worse than getting to the application stage and having to battle a bunch of contamination. All in all, keeping a clean workspace from the beginning of the install will help you to avoid contaminations that could cause a problem later on in the installation process. Building good cleaning habits now will save you a lot of time in the future. Up next, Lawrence is going to show us how he preps his workspace and the vehicle prior to installing ExoShield. Hello everyone, I'm Lawrence Neely. I'm the master trainer for ExoShield and welcome to ExoShield Academy. From start to finish, basically before I even bring a car into the garage, I'm going to power wash it basically from the front doors forward because this is all areas that you're going to be touching up against. Um, you can introduce as you're doing an install um, debris into the film if you're not real thorough. So I wash everything off really get in around the windshield if it's got rubber seals or if it's frameless and we can get in the grooves in between and really power wash those off. So I clean everything. I get in these grooves, get in the grooves of the glass real thoroughly and taking the extra time to be real thorough about it just makes your life so much better towards the end. Um, my goal is always that I'm going to use one piece to get a job done and uh, the least amount of dirt I get in that piece and so forth just makes your life that much happier. So taking a little extra time to clean everything off, uh, get in here, get down here in the cowl and get all the dirt you can out. Then I bring it in and then I still am gonna scrub the glass down at least two more times, maybe even three more times. So again, you cannot clean too much. It just, uh, you can go a little overboard as far as time taken, but um, you can't clean too much. Now inside the shop, I usually keep my floor mopped because again, in Las Vegas, it gets very dusty and no matter what you do, it gets in the cracks of the, of the garage door. Uh, so uh, I've always mopped out the floor. Um, I have a swamp cooler, I have a fan. Um, when I'm doing an install, the fan and the swamp cooler get turned off just because whether they are have screens on them or not, you're still moving air and that can lift contamination from wherever. So that just helps eliminate. Uh, so those are things to think about because we're put, putting a clear product onto a clear product. So anything that gets in between, you're gonna see. Similar to many of your other services, a proper prep is going to make your life so much easier come installation time. For consideration when it comes to cleaning solutions, we recommend keeping it simple. Use whichever solution you're currently using when you wash and prep vehicles. One thing to keep in mind, if your windshield already has a coating on it, you're gonna to need to remove it before installing ExoShield. IPA or a glass polishing compound work great. With the prep finished, it's time to pull your ExoShield off the roll and get it placed onto the windshield.